It's summer, y'all, and we want to make something fresh and delicious. So today we are making Chinese chicken salad summer rolls by Chrissy Teigen. She came up with this idea because she's combining her two favorite things, chicken salad, well, Chinese chicken salad, and summer rolls, and I think it's brilliant. Or so you say. I'm skeptical. What? All right. There's only one way to prove this, if it's good or not. Let's get cooking. All right guys, so the first thing we need to do is make the dressing. So we need some peanut oil or vegetable oil, rice vinegar, spicy mustard, soy sauce, honey, sriracha, sesame oil, crushed garlic, salt. Just gonna mix that all up together. I'm actually going the jar route, which she did suggest. Next, we are going to make the filling for the summon roll. So, so we're going to use some chicken breast. So I just bought a rotisserie chicken and made it easier in my life. Some shredded lettuce, purple cabbage, shredded carrots. Um, for you brave souls out there, some cilantro. And she says just the cilantro leaves. So I just kind of plucked a couple. And then some thinly sliced red onion. So we're gonna take a third of that dressing and we're gonna pour it over our salad. Now we're gonna mix going to put our sesame seeds over. Add a little more. I just know I'm gonna love this sauce, so I added more. Just be careful, I know you love the dressing, but you can overdress your salad, and that's not good. I'm not overdressing. It's <laughs> gonna be perfect. Look at this, look how pretty. But just remember, you don't want it to be too wet because it's gonna go in the summer roll, and if summer roll gets too wet, it'll break. Moving on to the next step, we're gonna make our summer roll. You ready to roll? As suggested in her recipe, we, I have a damp paper towel on my work counter. Rice paper, pretty cool stuff. And I have my hot water here. It actually doesn't even have to be hot, but it'll obviously soften a lot quicker if it is. So you dunk it in. And start stuffing. You're gonna add in a couple wonton noodles for that effect. Oh, look at these delicious things. And then you just roll it like a burrito. And I'm gonna put it on a bed of lettuce because it tends to get sticky, so you do not want to lay them next to each other. Just like you are, release your control, start to let go, take a night off and let yourself go a little crazy. Ready? One, two, three, let's go. go. I like it a lot. I really do. Oh, it's so fresh. The wonton strips are a must. I love that crunch. I love the dressing. I just love the flavor. They're wrapping it a little sticky, so if you haven't had these, or I don't know, these aren't usually that sticky in the restaurants for me, but some, some reason mine are. But if you can get over that, it tastes really good, says I. So what do you think, Kat? Salad's great, but to wrap it up in the summer roll wrapping, the texture, I just hate it. I do. And I love summer rolls. Eat the salad. You don't need to roll it up, but it's fun. It's something fun to do, but I don't think you should do it like on purpose. <laughs> I think we're agreeing on the, the basics that it is a salad and it's fresh and it's rolled in the skin, but we just have different opinions on whether that's a good idea or not. So I say it's great. Kat says, no thank you. You have like a summer roll party and have all the different ingredients and have your friends come over. They can pick whatever they want and they can roll it themselves. And that way you don't have to worry about it being pretty or not because they made it. Try it out if you're interested. Maybe you might like it just like Gina. So make sure you subscribe, hit that bell so that you don't miss another video and we'll see you guys next week. Bye.